Good morning, everyone, and uh, belated Merry Christmas to you. I'm actually recording while I'm at work, and there's a reason for that, and I'll get into that in a little bit, but it's typically not where I would uh, sit and record. I would prefer to either uh, sit and record whenever I'm either at the house or perhaps even setting up a tripod in the exterior as I'm continuing to outfit Sarah. Um, just for those that are new to the channel, I am outfitting a 2004 Nissan Xterra for overland travel that I consider kind of a season one, if you will, because if the entire channel was only about outfitting the Xterra, then it would only be about six months of footage, and then I would be done with the YouTube channel. I would have to create another one. So I'm morphing this uh, as I go to see how it, how it works out. But anyway... Um, the Xterra, Sarah, the Xterra is the uh, platform that I'm outfitting. And I wanted to kind of follow up on where I am with that. But before I do that, I want to talk about what happened yesterday. I am now, obviously, at work, and I was yesterday. And part of the reason why I don't like to record from this location is because even as I'm recording this, there's a camera right there recording me and those monitors are some of the locations where I can see the footage um, and obviously my boss and everybody else would have access to me recording so again typically I wouldn't do that from here but I was at work yesterday and I had my laptop and I uh, and correct me if I'm wrong perhaps leave some comments in the uh, uh, location below and let me know if I'm doing the wrong thing but I've done fairly extensive research on youtubers and what they're doing is they're editing from an external hard drive so that keeps all of the content in one location and when it's full you get another one and, and continue to work that way it frees up the laptop obviously then you'll have the speed that you need to do the editing and so I had uh, my earbuds in, and I was on the computer with my external hard drive plugged in, and I was editing from the external hard drive. I had a video up, and I used Final Cut Pro X, uh, FCPX, and I basically had my fingers on the JKL, and I was stop, forward, backward, you know, getting a video right where I wanted it so I can blade it and, and get, it, uh, get it edited and heard a and the screen went blank the computer was off it would not come back on would not reset would not do anything and at first i was thinking well it had to be something from the hard drive that popped it but i don't know how that's possible i know that the power for the external hard drive or any power that's required for the external hard drive would come from the computer and so I guess now I'm thinking that maybe it's the computer that's a problem. I've got an appointment with uh, Apple support tomorrow at around noon, 12.30, I think, 12.40. And I'll bring the computer in with the uh, external hard drive. And the only other thing that I had, again, was my earbud that was plugged into the uh, side of it, of the computer. I don't know if all of that was just a perfect storm that caused a problem or if it was one or the other. So I'm going to bring all of that in and see if... Uh, see if I can get it fixed. Now, here's, I guess, my biggest concern. Obviously, the first thing I thought was, if it's the external hard drive and now it's gone, all of the video that I have uh, for the um, upcoming video, what I was actually editing, and all of the previous video, music, sound effects, whatever, all of that was on that external hard drive. If that external hard drive is gone, I lost everything. Now, because I'm so early in this and I only have four videos posted I was working on the fifth and 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 again I've got a lot of raw footage too that I want to maybe use for behind the scenes type stuff if that's the case all of that's gone so again you know leave me a comment let me know if I should be using an external hard drive if I should keep everything on a computer and then maybe later move it over because I know that uh, that I have to reacquire all of that that uh, video if I move it and need to edit it later, I have to either bring it all back onto my laptop and then edit because Final Cut Pro won't recognize it after you've moved it. Um, so anyway, uh, I 
just wanted to put something up because I don't want you guys to think that I've forgotten about you or that I'm you know moving on if you will I'm moving on but with my plan not just moving on so hopefully this kind of you know gives everybody an idea I'm, I again I'm going to Apple support tomorrow and see if I can't get the computer up and running I don't know how long it's going to take I've got a trip planned for um, January the 10th 11th around there to like the 15th 16th or whatever I'm going to be heading out to Georgia and visit my uh, older brother and um, I'm going to be you know putting together footage if you will on my um, on my phone and my GoPro and whatnot and hopefully I'll have a way to compile and get all that stuff together and edited uh, as it stands right now this video will more than likely be either edited on my phone or my iPad and I'll go ahead and put this up tomorrow because I was planning on posting a video anyway tomorrow and um, we'll go from there um, I appreciate your patience I know that this is definitely not the kind of message that I wanted to to send along this early in the game but it is something that I just need to make sure that I present to you guys so that I'm not dropping the ball so thanks for watching if you like the videos that you've seen you like this video or you have questions or answers or, or anything uh, for me or anything that I can provide for you just let me know down in the comments below and uh, I will work on either recovering that footage or just move forward because I wanted to talk a little bit about what progress I've already made and that was going to be included in this upcoming video so I'll work to to get that uh, fixed and we'll go from there take care so just as an example of my tenacity this image is from a confidence course that I took my middle school students on a couple of years ago and this particular obstacle is one that you have to climb up on a pole I believe it was a 20 or 25 foot pole and then on the very top of the pole you had to balance yourself to a point where you could jump out reach and grab a ring and on that day only two people actually got that ring obviously myself and a 14 year old boy as evidence of my commitment to move forward i also branded myself quote unquote you'll see that uh, in upcoming videos and i was able to find some footage on my cell phone that i recorded on my way out to my mom's place on the 21st of december she wanted to have an early christmas dinner and watch the convergence of Jupiter and Saturn and I was able to get an image of that that, I, that you may have seen early in the video but uh, this is just something that is available that was online and it, it shows obviously a, a telescopic view of it. I thought it was kind of interesting and I thought that I would include that on the end of the video. If you like what you see, please do me a favor, just hit the like, and uh, if you haven't already, please subscribe, and then hit that notification bell so you can get upcoming videos. Jesus, the